Hello friends, this video on NEAT Ecology is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Question number 26. Given below is an imaginary pyramid of numbers. What could be one of the possibilities about certain organisms at some of the different levels? Okay, so here we are given a pyramid of numbers. So what do we see? What is PP? PP represents primary producer. This represents primary consumer, secondary consumer and tertiary consumer. So what do we see here? We see that there is only one primary producer and 500 primary consumer depends upon this one primary producer. Then 50 secondary consumer depends on 500 primary consumer and 10 tertiary consumers depend on the 50 secondary consumers. So this is something which we can understand from the picture. Now, what are the options that are given to us? First option is level PC insects and level SC is small insectivorous birds. So if PC is insects, that means primary consumers are insects and secondary consumers are insectivorous birds. That means birds which eat insects. Is that possible? Yes, that is very much possible. If, if primary consumer is insects, then the secondary consumers can be insectivorous birds which feed on insects. So this is correct. This could be a possibility. Second is level PP is phytoplanktons. That means this PP primary producer is phytoplanktons in C and whale is on the top level that is tertiary consumer. Now, if you look at the numbers, you see there is only one primary producer, right? So that means that there is just one phytoplankton and you have 10 whales on the top level. So which is not really correct because you also need to balance out on the numbers, right? Because the producers are the one who are going to, who are the autotrophs. They are going to produce the food and everybody else is going to be directly or indirectly dependent on them. So if you look at any of the options in B, C or D, the logically they are not correct. For example, uh, here it says that level one is people trees and level secondary consumer is sheep. So that is also not again true because the sheep, if, if, even if we assume that the sheep are the secondary consumers, then what would be the primary consumer, right? Because the sheep generally feed on the grasses. So they should fall under the category of primary consumers and not secondary consumers. Again, last option, you have level PC as rats, that is primary consumer as rats. Now, primary consumers are generally herbivores, but, rat, but rats are not herbivores. Rats also feed on other small insects or other organisms. So, rats should occupy secondary consumer level and not primary consumer level. So, we see that option B, C and D are not correct, but option A could be one of the possibilities about uh, the organisms at different levels of this particular pyramid. Question number 27. The second stage of hydrocery is occupied by plants like Azola, Typha, Salix and Valisneria. Now let us quickly recall the various stages of hydrocery. So the first stage is the plankton stage where you have the phytoplanktons and the zooplanktons. The second stage is the submerged state. So second stage is submerged stage where you have the submerged plants. Now, can you think of examples of submerged plants? So one of the example of submerged plant could be Vallisneria. So the, this second stage is suitable for growth of deep rooted submerged species. So Vallisneria is one such example. So here from out of this list, Vallisneria could be a plant in the second stage of hydrocerae. So hydro, what is hydrocery? It is the plant succession which occurs in an area of fresh water and second stage is for submerged plants. Question number 28. Identify the possible link A in the following food chain. Plant, insect, frog, A and eagle. So A has to be something which feeds on frog and which can be eaten up by the eagle. So can you think of an order? Now look at the options which are given here. Rabbit. The rabbit feeds on plants. It won't feed on frog. If you talk about wolf. Wolf again would not feed on frog and moreover wolf would not be eaten up by the eagle. Cobra. So cobra is a snake and snake feeds on frogs. So cobra is a correct option. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी नाइन ऑफ द टोटल इंसिडेंट सोलर रेडिएशन द प्रोपोर्शन ऑफ पी ए आर इज वॉट इज पी ए आर पी ए आर इज फोटो सिंथेटिकली एक्टिव रेडिएशन सो दिस इज फोटो सिंथेटिकली एक्टिव रेडिएशन सो ऑफ द टोटल इंसिडेंट रेडिएशन हाउ मच इज फोटो सिंथेटिकली एक्टिव रेडिएशन सो अबाउट फिफ्टी परसेंट ऑफ द सोलर रेडिएशन इज फोटो सिंथेटिकली एक्टिव एंड टू टू टेन परसेंट ऑफ द फोटो सिंथेटिकली एक्टिव रेडिएशन इज कैप्चर्ड बाई द फोटो सिंथेटिक प्लांट्स सो द करेक्ट ऑप्शन वुड बी सी क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी क्वर्कर स्पीशीज आर द डोमिनेंट कॉम्पोनेंट इन टेम्परेट डिसीडियस फॉरेस्ट एल्पाइन फॉरेस्ट स्क्रब फॉरेस्ट और ट्रॉपिकल रेन फॉरेस्ट सो वॉट इज क्वर्कस क्वर्कस स्पीशीज आर नथिंग बट द ओक ट्रीज सो ओक मोस्ट ऑफ द ओक ट्रीज दे शेड देर लिव्स ड्यूरिंग ऑटम वॉर्म समर और मॉडरेटली कोल्ड विंटर सो दे आर सीन इन टेम्परेट डिसीडियस फॉरेस्ट so these type of forests they experience warm summer and moderately cold winter thank you please visit examfear.com for free quality education you can learn with a simple four step learning process wherein you can watch video lessons you can ask your questions you can refer notes and you can take a free online test we have content for class 6 to 12 on physics chemistry mathematics and biology along with practical videos so please subscribe to our channel for daily updates thank you